three episodes of SAO left, and that's it, man. It's been a long journey, but hey, it's also been like over half a year, so maybe the journey was a little bit too long. What's going on? Last episode felt like the finale of the War of the Underworld, right? Kirito does the craziest shit. Release recollection, both the Blue Rose Sword and Knight uh, Blades, uh, the Dark Knight. What was it called? Knight. Night Sky Blade, right? Both the blades went through release recollection while Golden Eye was activated. That's the shit that I wanted to happen since season 3. We finally got it. Mr. Miller, he's out. I don't think he's done just yet. I don't think, like, the same situation with him has happened with Vasago, right? Miller simply got kicked out, and we were too late. But Asna stayed behind. So now what? Kirito and Asna spends 200 years together? No, here's what I think is gonna happen. I think that... We'll have some heartfelt touching moment between Asta and Kirito as they realize that they have to spend now 200, and 200 years inside together. But as they make the resolve, maybe that's when Kaiba shows up. Because that SAO pod blinking, that's still been foreshadowed and hasn't been executed just yet. Maybe Kaiba is the one that's going to return us home. It's going to be a happy ending. Let's begin today's reaction. <laughs> Ejecting! Alice is out! Is that Alice? Alice's luck light? Yeah, we got Alice. Asuna staying behind. And you know what? If I was Asuna too, I'd probably do the same shit. It'd be stupid to just leave Kirito behind like that, right? No shot. I would just leave. I'd stay in. I don't think this is a stupid decision. Or maybe, hear me out. This is Asna's endgame all this time. Too many goddamn hoes around my man Kirito. Now, Asna has created a situation for 200 years they can be alone together. This is her endgame plan. Everything is according to her plan right now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't know about that. Three, two, one. Sayonara. Sayonara. Time beyond time. Still an ocean turtle. Pika at least is gonna have that date with Rinko though. Wah, wah. There's no way to stop it? Really? He just says maybe there's a way. JSDF people? Ten years have already passed. Is it that big of a deal for them to spend 200 years alone together? I mean, they can both chop down Vasago. It'd be fun date activities. If anything, their bonds, Kirito and Asuna's, their bond will be just stronger than anyone else, right? Like, 200 years is a fucking long time, right? For sure, for sure. IRL, because the acceleration is going so fast, it's gonna be over real quick. But once 200 years year is up, their brains are just gonna get fried? How would that work? <laughs> What is it? Okay. Kikuka cooking? Wait, where's the body? I was hoping to see Yanai down here somewhere. This body just completely just splat. Because he fell, right? This is directly below. I'm not sure if it's directly below. Oh shit, she types fast. Gate open. Okay, we got Mr. Critter. Vasako stuck. Miller should be here somewhere still. Is he gonna take the bait? Yes! They're falling for the bait though. Okay, okay. This is for that plan. Wait, this is the idiot! 
I just realized this is the dumbass that shot the fucking console. <laughs> this is Brig, huh? He has an actual name too, Brig. <laughs> he bricked the entire fucking plan, bro. <laughs> Surprise how important he is right now. Yanai, there he is. I thought his body would have gotten just complete tomato splashed. Damn, wrinkle. Wah, wah. From above. Oh no, Kikoka shot! Nah, he got a vest. He's got a vest. Yeah, yeah, vest. Easy. I've never obviously had this experience, but like, wonder how much it hurts, right? You got a bulletproof vest, but you still get shot by it. The pain, it still must be like really really painful right wait brig is dead brig is dead bro i didn't see brig get shot i thought i'm just shooting up and the kikoka got hit he's already dead what the hell last resort measures they got more plans Critters got more plans? Yeah, I didn't even see Brig get shot, man. Like, let's... Oh, whoa, there's Miller. Okay, before we go there, before we go there. Uh, like, what just happened? I know Kikuka shot back, but I didn't see any hits landing, right? This is the last time we see Brig, right? Look at this. And that's it. And then, and then Brig is dead, bro. And then nothing else? Uh, next time you see Brig... <laughs> we were just spamming. He got shot. Lucky. Lucky. Let's fucking go. Miller! Gabriel! <laughs> He's back! Your soul. <laughs> Going crazy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell was that? Did he just wake up? What was that laugh? He's like, ha <laughs> <clears throat> Well then. What do we do now? It seems like he just woke up. He's like, he link ended and he woke up laughing. Okay. He's back and then just calm. <laughs> okay. Vasa goes forever stuck, man. What? Who's that? That's him. But he's out. He's like, is this his soul form right now? Cause that's his body. He's out right now. Who is that? What? That's you. Your soul. You're in your soul form. Whose hand? Whose hand? Little Alicia. Alicia. Oh, revenge. End him. Alicia, say your soul will be so sweet and just end him right now. Nah, you come with me. Damn. That's scary. We're going to hell. What the hell? Damn. Remember? He stuck a pen up there or something, right? Something, right? He penetrated that ear to try to get that soul before. This is disturbing. What the fuck? What the fuck? So like, I think this is their way of showing, yeah, Miller basically at the end versus Kirito. He got his ass fried, fluck light fried, and his body's pretty much just a vegetable now. Souls out, and this is like imagery of his quote unquote punishment, right? Because Alicia was the one that he killed in the past. And even if this, if this didn't actually happen, right? The show was trying to tell us this is Miller's end, a suiting end where Alicia and the hands of other people's maybe that he consumed before is now dragging them to hell. And goodbye, Miller, man. Creepy. <laughs> Goodbye, Gabe. Mira, teacher.
He's gone. He done. Same with Vasago. Well, Vasago has potential to return, but Miller's done. He's just done, bro. <laughs> now, the hand gripping like this. You think that shit happened because of the girl there, Alicia? Because like the face was like that, but the hand. Because like his traumatic effect, I don't know. It, it's, it's all over the place right now, right? Who knows if the hand placement like this was always like that and his body was already dead and everything we saw in the soul was like... I think he was already dead, but like... Bro, look at the nails. Yeah, I'm just realizing. Look at the fucking nails. Because he gripped so hard. He gripped so hard because of how in terror he was and the nails like basically came out. Because no one actually peeled the nails back, right? It's not Alicia going to be like, oh, take one nail. I think this is because he was gripping hard. Now Vasago is busy being a tree. I didn't get to see Vasago there. We don't get to see anything. I don't know. It just... It's, they hardly show anything. His face does not look good. It, 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 there's a lot of wrinkles here. The face kind of looks like a tree. Look at it, bro. It, it's looking really bad. They're both dead. <laughs> Yeah, there he is. All shriveled up dried. Yes, Brig is an idiot. It's GG. You guys should get out of here. From the NSA? Oh, Captain's dead. I'm the captain now. Oh, I'm the captain now. Yo, Blunt Mustachio, he's, he's popping off now. These are the only two main notable characters from this side. Uh-oh. He gonna do something stupid. The engine, okay. Go to the engine. How many years has passed? And then what happens when no more memory? Smart, you should get out of here. But the engine. Uh-oh. Shit's about to blow up. Shit's about to blow up, right? They're getting out of here. Oh, boy. We have a pressurized water nuclear reactor, baby. Oh, boy. You ready for a nuclear explosion? How the fuck are we getting out of here, bro? There's so many different, you know, time uh, restraints now, right? When is this going to blow? We got to get Kirito and Asuna before that. Yeah. Well, someone needs to go defuse it. Someone needs to defuse it. Are you going to go in? Oh, shit. <sighs> JSDF Connie, bro. I think he's about to make a big sacrifice, man. Oh, man. Good luck, bro. Nakanishi. It's so hot. I bet as soon as he enters in there, his face, his skin, this all just kind of like peel back from the amount of heat, man. Alright. Hmm? Hmm? This is the Niemon's Ichiemon different drones, right? Yeah, the drones are lighting up. Nemon can't walk properly or something, right? I don't know. Uh-oh. Kikuka gonna make a sacrifice too? Uh-oh. No, he's about to make some kind of crazy move too. Kikuka! Gonna be okay. Stay cool. He's bleeding. Oh, shit. It was a lie. The pool of blood shows that it wasn't just the vest that 
block the bullet, bro. He actually is bleeding out. So he's gonna use this opportunity to sacrifice himself if he's gonna die anyways. Damn, bro. Connie? Nakanishi? This is the main control room? I'm not sure. No! Is he shot? I can't tell. Yeah, he's got shot. Ooh. Yo, why the fuck is he still here? Why is Blood Mustachio here? He wanted to fuck shit up. To make sure everything's blown up no matter what? I thought he just like rigged a nuclear reactor and get out, but... Bro has a personal vendetta. Niemon! Niemon! How did it get activated? What? Kaiba? Wait! Wait! Kaiba is a Nemo? No, no, whoa, 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 whoa. Huh? How? Because the last time, and the color, SAO color as well. Remember there? Remember the SAO pod? It, it was blinking blue or some shit. And yeah, I, I guess it kind of makes sense. He fucking transported his data all across here and then implanted his name on sure, who cares? Oh fuck. Kaiba came back as Terminator. I don't think now's the time to be monologuing, bro. Okay. Connect those two worlds. <laughs> it looks like Niemon's like bleeding, man. Look. Because <laughs> like the oils, right? But it looks like it's blood. Kikoka! Kikoka clutch? Amazing rush out of nowhere! Not the battery cable! Niemon walks, bro! This is so hype. Bro, the way that they're animating Nemo's like, you know, uh, injuries with these like quote unquote blood, it's so hype. You can do it! No! He's so close! He's right there! Don't give up! Ah, shit. Now what? It's so close. Someone's gotta go in there, bro. Don't give up! Oh shit. Talk no jutsu, bro. Rinko's about to hype him up. Somehow, we're about to defeat fucking science right now. We got no battery source. I don't give a fuck. Rinko about to juice him up. Let's go. That's right. Pete Cliff! The commander! The greatest rival! Miracles! Oh! I don't know how the hell this it out, bro. How the hell did you just use that roleplay monologue to get him, you know, battery used up? But did you see that? When Rinko clutched onto her pendant, you see this shit bleeding. She's bleeding. Look how hard she clutched it. <laughs> the only scientific reasoning as to how this happened is Kaiba just wanted Rinko to say that. He shut himself off there. No, no, this is not mental image. We're not in the simulation right now. Kaiva intentionally shut him off there, acted as he's offline, made Rinko do all that shit, and then he's back. That's what happened here. <gasps> he's back! Number two? Niemon! Wait, it still blew up near the reactor, but I... Uh, I hope that's good. We are good. We are good. We are good. 
Okay, the explosion just took out his hand. Okay, I'm like, dude, was the explosion big enough to like fucking destroy the reactor? Now we good, we good. Only his hand got blown up there. What a hero. Look at that pose, bro. Look at that pose. Salute Heathcliff. Akihiko Kaiba. Hi, bro. Never would have imagined Kaiba to turn into Robocop and stop the bombs from going off. I thought that he was going to somehow show up in the underworld and help Kirito and, Al and uh, Asuna like get out of doing some fucking hacks. But like, nah, I thought he'd show up and be like authority level fucking Heathcliff and log out or do some shit like that. But all right, let's go. Still outside. This is the bad guys, right? They came through the submarine. Critter's getting now safe. Bomb should have gone off, but there was no boom. Meaning? Hans, blonde mustachio. Okay. The only reason Hans stood her back is because he's close with Brig. I guess that makes sense. Because, like, logically, like, why the fuck are you staying back, right? But. He was kind of upset when Brig was dead, so he wanted to die a warrior's death and, I don't know, die together with Brig. I, I can respect it. Huh? Hmm? Oi, Wait. Huh? Body missing, too. Vasago and Miller. What about Vasago? It was only Brig and Captain Miller, but Vasago is already... They didn't recover his body, though? Alright. They just abandoned Vasago? Wait! Who moved his body? Someone moved the body or he moved himself. Only found Captain... But we saw Vasago. We saw him in the pot all shriveled up with white hair. What do you mean? Rinko-san, <laughs> あと<笑><笑> I think, th th has this line been said before? I swear to god, this is not the first time I've read this dialogue recently watching anime. Remember? What other anime did they mention this? Where an anime indirect, just like directly just shit on Hollywood. But what was that anime? Was it SAO? It might have been just SAO again, bro. They just double dipping. <laughs> yeah, Vasago said it? Okay, okay. That's funny. Wonder if those passages are from the light novel or A1 Pictures is just flexing and being like, yeah, you could this shit, bro. This shit better in Hollywood movies, man. <laughs> ええ、聞こえます。どうしました僕らはぶち取り外せたんですが。ニーモンが。ニーモンズミッシング。ヴァスコズミッシング。イズ of all the characters, I, I, I don't think there's any, been any other members from like the terrorist crew that we know about. What the fuck? Yo, Vasaka about to show up. What is happening? What? Bro, is there a post courtesy? There is, there is, there is, there is, there is, there is, there is. There is, there is. All right, we're not done yet. We're not done yet. Kirito? Kirito and Asuna. This is the ending of last episode. Where Kirito realizes Asuna stayed back, okay? Things ain't so bad. We could just hang out here for 200 years. Go chop Vasago down. Still no kiss. As long as we remember. 
as long as we don't forget one second. Well, if yeah, there's a limited amount of memory. What happens when your memories are overloaded? Does then do you start to then lose your memories in the past in order to make some space? Right? Because the human brain, it has limited space. So like, we're going to forget all this shit, bro. <laughs> Eagle mentioned before Silica. Yeah, as long as we don't forget. Gee, I wonder if they're going to forget, guys. 200 years? That's an insane... Really? What if after like... One month they start fighting? Like... You know what they say? Uh, so... One of the things that you actually don't want to do... If you get like a girlfriend or a boyfriend in the, in the beginning... Or maybe you do want to do this, it's like a filter test, is... Do some events where you're kind of at odds against each other. Whether or not it be some kind of challenge. Maybe tra traveling is too much. But like, when you're put into those heated situations, it really shows what kind of person they are. Especially if you go traveling together. A lot of couples, they start to realize they fucking hate each other if they spend all the time together. Or even like, moving in together, right? Like... Uh, there's a fun line of like, oh, you know, you never make your friends be roommates because if you do, that friendship is not going to fucking sustain itself. Alright. Yeah, staying together in the same house for a while in season 1 versus 200 years have been different though. Asuna's wings are so cool. Straight up, her design is amazing. This is the best Asuna design. Her wings are so sick and Kirito still has dirty spriggan ass wings, man. I hate them spriggans. Is that it? They mean they fucking? What's going on here? What's the image you're trying to show me as they fly off and you see a butterfly and a fucking flower pollinating? What, what, are, you, what are you trying to tell me, bro? They having sex? Like, what do you mean? <laughs> and is that it? That is the episode. And goddamn, Kaiba showing up as a Robocop? Defusing the bomb, not really defusing, but making sure the bomb doesn't blow up the reactor, bro. Akihiko Kaiba redemption just continues to get better and better and better. And yes, it's still my head cannon. That Rinko only said that shit and he booted himself back up because Kaiba himself shut himself down for dramatic effect. Now, plot wise, what the hell is happening with Vasago and the missing Niemon? It means that there's someone in here moving the bodies around, but I do not know which member will be doing that. Because all of these dudes are gone. Only the blonde mustachio stuck back. Right? There should be no one else unless there's someone from our side. Like a fucking Yanai Jr. Moving this shit around. Vasago's body's gone. Nemo's body's gone. What could that mean? A random janitor service or maybe Vasago return in Nemo? I'm not really sure but the story isn't over yet. There's still mysteries and there's two episodes left. We'll find that out next time. If you're still here though, and if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.